now the topic before us is how does a forex supply shortage affect exchange rate now here firstly we will understand the reasons for decrease in supply of foreign exchange why there is decrease in forex supply or what are the reasons reasons for decrease in supply first reason is decrease in exports suppose earlier we were sending or exporting goods 100 kg to other country b but now our exports have decreased to 80 kg now we are exporting only 80 kg so naturally when we were exporting more we were getting more foreign currency as the exports have decreased we are now getting less foreign currency next is political instability foreign direct investment or portfolio investment comes into any country if there is political stability investors from the rest of the world like to make investment in politically stable countries but when there is political instability in a country the investors from abroad do not like to make investment in that country rather they pull out their investments from that country so when there is political instability the forex supply decreases if the investment climate in the country is not favorable then the foreign exchange supply reduces it may be also possible that government buys foreign exchange as a part of their monetary or physical policy the government sometimes buy foreign exchange when it happens the supply of foreign exchange in the market reduces now we will understand what happens when there is decrease in the foreign exchange supply as an individual we may say that we are not concerned with foreign exchange we are not related with foreign currency because we are from a middle class family we have no relatives abroad we do not make any investments abroad because already we are living from hand to mouth but here we are studying from the national level so as you know that ox is the x axis oy is the y axis on ox on the x axis we will study quantity of forex foreign exchange supplied on x x on y axis it is exchange rate or the price of foreign currency in relation to the domestic currency here it dd is the demand curve which is downward sloping ss is the supply curve which is upward sloping so due to the interaction of demand and supply curve exchange rate is or equilibrium point is e and the quantity supplied is oq quantity of foreign exchange which is supplied now if the supply of foreign exchange decreases what happens 
if the supply curve supply decreases it means that the supply curve shifts upward or to the left if the supply decreases it becomes OQ1 then equilibrium point also shifts upward and exchange rate also shifts upward earlier say it the exchange rate was 83 we are supposed here taking the example of 1 US dollar is equal to 83 INR it means that to get 1 US dollar we the people living in India will have to pay 83 Indian rupee to get 1 US dollar but when the supply of US dollars has decreased exchange rate has increased it means that earlier we used to pay 83 to get 1 US dollar now we have to pay say 86 we are just taking example earlier we were getting 1 US dollar for 83 rupee but now to get it 1 US dollar we will have to pay 86 Indian rupee so what it means it means that it is the depreciation of domestic currency how there is depreciation earlier we were getting 1 US dollar only for 83 rupees but now as the supply has reduced supply of foreign currency has reduced now we are getting 1 US dollar for 86 rupee it also means that there is appreciation of foreign currency how it is earlier the residents of USA were getting 83 Indian rupee for 1 US dollars but now they are getting 86 rupees for 1 US dollars. Thanks for watching. If you like our course, please spare some time to give a star rating to our course.